and all of them wonderful staples for your home. And tonight we are jumping right in to our Wagyu right into Kobe style beef burgers. Absolutely. So what we have here is item M85224. You can receive 10 or 20 of five and a half ounce Wagyu Kobe style beef burgers. So the 10 count is on five easy payments of $15.40. And the 20 count is on five easy payments of $28.60. That's an $11 savings if you get double the offer. Right. But the Wagyu Kobe style beef is a really special cut of meat. And Ray, I think you should jump in with all the amazing facts Definitely. and the fun statistics that I love about and this Brittany, burger. And Brittany, you know this burger all too well because yes. we eat it every weekend, right? Our mm -hmm. kids have grown to love this burger. First and foremost, I mean, this is the one we're always pulling out of the freezer every single weekend because they just love it, right? They refer mm -hmm. to it as Poppy's Burger. And when we're out at a great steakhouse or a restaurant, our son tries a burger, he knows right away if it's our burger or not, right? Mm -hmm. And he knows it, number one, because of the process in which we make it, right? You can see how this is just falling apart, Brittany. It's very loose knit, right? And that's because of the process in which we make these burgers. They're gonna eat like an incredible steak, but also be just very tender. It's like the most tender steak you've ever had, but it has an incredible bite. But the flavor is just packed with flavor, Brittany. And it's packed with flavor because we're starting with Wagyu beef, right? If you've ever heard of the term Kobe beef, you've gone to maybe a really high-end steakhouse. Kobe, what the breed, Kobe beef is otherwise known as Wagyu beef, right? That's the breed of the animal in which it's raised. So this starts with Wagyu beef. And you talked about some of those facts just a second ago, right? In the United States, there's 30 million beef cattle. Every year raised for beef eating, there's only 5,000 of these Wagyu beef cattle. So when you think about that, only 5,000 of them to go around for a whole entire year, it's why it's so limited, and it's why when it's available on QVC, you definitely want to pick it up because it's not something that we can do all the time. Right. I love, love that statistic because it just shows you how special this is. And like you said, right, when we see right. this in the high-end steakhouses, that MP is always yep. next to it. Market price, otherwise known as open up your wallet. <laughs> exactly. Because it is, you know, it is rare, and it's rare to be able to have this in your home. But these burgers are full full of flavor. They are mouth-watering and they are so juicy. And they eat a lot, I think, like a steak. They do. I skip the bun a lot and I will just go ahead and have my little fixings on my plate. But this is something that if you do skip the bun, it is going to eat like a steak. But it's still right. Cheeseburgery enough for your kids it to is. enjoy it, and like pretty, you can our see, son. Just, look, you're seeing the raw meat here on the screen, right? You can see how loosely knit this is. This is not a typical burger. If you've gone and bought another burger, maybe on a dot-com website or even at a retail grocery store, you'll see them very tightly compact, right? We tried burgers all morning this morning because we were working on different um, different flavors and different blends to bring to you. But the process in which we make these, and you're gonna see the animation in just a second, makes this burger a lot more uh, loosely knit. So you're gonna see, it's gonna cook in about half the amount of time because that steam or the heat is actually cooking through the burger instead of going around the burger. And when it does that, it's allowing it to cook in half the amount of time, but also shrink less. So when you cook this burger compared to your typical burger you're gonna get from a grocery store, or even maybe some other websites, you are gonna see that it's gonna cook less and it's gonna cook less because in that process in which we make it, that keeps it super loose knit like that. It's like you went to a Wagyu beef farm, right? Got the Wagyu meat, bought a meat grinder, ground it at your house, then decided to portion it into these beautiful five ounce portions. And actually these are five and a half ounce portions. Five these and ones, half so these are the largest burger that we offer at QVC. So these are gonna be really filling, really hearty. And I just, you know, there's not many places you can go to have a Wagyu burger for this price of about $11 a serving. So, Brittany, we, many people talk about steak burger, right? And they throw that name around really loosely. Mm -hmm. Usually they say steak burger because it's made from all the trimmings that come off of their steak. So if they're cutting a tenderloin or ribeye or sirloin, they're taking all the pieces and the scrap that doesn't qualify for that steak and they're putting it into the burger. That is not what we do. And I was putting my glove on because I want to show you here. This is a whole piece of Wagyu beef chuck, right? So this is what we start with. It's solid muscle meat like this. We're not taking trimmings. We're not taking scrap. We're taking the meat that comes directly from the farm. It's brought into our facility where we're going to grind it and turn it into beef patties. And that's really what separates it apart. So it really is a, a steak burger, right? It's We're starting with real steak, not trim, not pieces of meat and things like that. Right. 
and if you want to know how you're going to be receiving these, this is literally my dream. these are individually packaged right. just like this. so if you're receiving ten or twenty, they're going to come in a bag like this, individually packaged and blast frozen. so once upon a time before i was with my very handsome husband here, i used to buy burgers in the grocery store. and when they weren't individually packaged and blast frozen like this, right. i had a lot of waste because whatever i had left over and i didn't want to cook, i'd wrap it and it would become mystery meat. or the blast freezing also really locks in the freshness it, too. it and does. it also just makes it really convenient, brittany, right? This so convenient. great as a burger. and by the way, just the way brittany showed them frozen like that, you're going to take them out and cook them from frozen, right? open up that package just like this, slap it on your grill. you don't have to thaw it out. but by the way, if you want to take it and do something else with it and make it even more special, you can make a chili or you know a, um, a you know meatloaf or meatballs yeah. or lasagna with a wagyu beef burger or with your wagyu beef ground beef because at the end of the day this is just wagyu ground beef that we folded into a burger for you so you really can use it for many different things but when you try this as a burger i promise you you're going to absolutely love it and you're going to want more and more of these in your freezer so 20 may sound like a lot but I promise you they will go fast. No, it goes a long way. It really does. And I love that you brought up the alternate things that you can do with this. But what I do want to point out, again, one of my favorites because it's such a time saver right. is when you cook this as a burger, you want to cook it from frozen. You do not have to thaw these out. If you want to take it out of that packaging and use it, like Ray said, for a meatball right. or a right. nacho topper, which we have done before, um, or put it in some sort of chili that you're making, or just if you need anything that you could use ground beef for, go ahead and defrost it. And then from there, you can use it as a base. So that 20 count, you're getting the savings of $11 on that one. But think about all the things that you could do with this right. burger. It's not just a burger. And no, this it's not. Brittany, these are cooked perfectly just the way you like it, right? Like perfect medium. That's my favorite. I like them a little bit more well done than that. But just look at how juicy these are, right? And they're that juicy because of the meat in which we started with. We started with Wagyu premium Kobe style beef burgers here, right? So we're starting with meat that is so limited, is rarely ever available at a grocery store, especially even at butcher shops because it's re it's retained or kept for the highest end steakhouses around the globe, right? So when you go to one of those five star steakhouses, even even higher, maybe a seven star steakhouse like the one we serve in the Middle East, these places are selling these products, one of these, one burger, right? For 30, 40, 50, even $100 at some places in our area. So it really is special when you can get 10 or 20 of these at QVC for the price of buying, you know, one of those meals at one of those steakhouses. It's something you want to definitely take advantage of. And when you talked a little bit earlier about the smash burger technology and how it's loose knit. Definitely. That really allows it to cook so evenly. Right. I, I mean, we just cooked these from scratch right here on air, right? And in a matter of the last four or so minutes that we've been on air, they're done. They're ready mm -hmm. to go. And, and they were from frozen. So it really is that easy. If you want to cook them in a pan, because it's going to get cold outside in a couple months, you can do that. But if you want to just throw these on the grill from a frozen state, you're going to love them each and every time. That's exactly what we do. And Ray and I talk a lot about our family and our children and how busy life is. And really, gathering around the table is what brings us together, even if it's just a few minutes. Right. So being able to put something on the table that we all love is always an added bonus for us at home. So just a reminder here of what you're receiving. This is item M85224. This is 10 or 20 of five and a half ounce Wagyu Kobe style beef burgers. The 10 count is on five easy payments of $15.40. And the 20 count is on five easy payments of $28.60. And that's with an $11 savings. So you have the free shipping and handling available to you for a great staple to have available in your freezer that's wonderful all year. And then coming up towards the end of our show tonight,